142. This thing rapidly 152. This thing rapidly intensifying. It's going to hit the what? radar technologies building right now. Yep. Power oh, flash no. is right there. Oh, my oh, gosh. Oh, no, wait. Nope. That's a subfort. Oh, wow. All right. I'm going to watch right, my truck here. There goes my truck rolling, and it's gone. Yeah, I wouldn't have survived. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are back in Twisted, continuing the Storm Chasing series. I'm joined by Ben, Jay Killen, and Tofu, and we are going to be using the TIV Convoy. These vehicles were used in the Discovery Channel's Storm Chasers, and that's a pretty cool show. So, uh, yeah, we're going to be sort of imitating that with this convoy. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright, so, Jay Killen, would you like to explain what weather we've got for today? Yeah, so we have a high risk with a STP value of 8 and a VTP value of 2, which is a pretty good amount. So when you consider the cape, which is at 4,800, that is actually quite a bit of cape. Same with the 3 cape, which is at 163. We also got some high lapse rates. We also have some high rain, too, at 1.43 inches. So there is a good chance we're going to have a lot of rain with these storms. And looking at the photograph, we do have a nice sickle shape. It's not as extreme or robust, and we only have around 383 SRH. But with the amount of cape we have, that probably won't be an issue. All right, sounds good. And now let's go ahead and let's get going. We've already got a storm, and I believe we've got a tornado on the ground. All right, so we're going to wait for them to start rolling out, and there they go. And uh, I guess I'll lead. I can already see the tornado. It's a pretty big tornado, and it looks to be way off in the distance there, so we're going to have to race there to catch up to it. Uh, that is a pretty solid-looking cone. Oh, I'm seeing oh, power, is that power flashes. flashes? Yeah. yeah. Might be crossing the road, then. It looks like it is. It's heading up towards Funkly. Actually, looks like it's going directly into Funkly, so that might be a problem. All right, we're starting to get that rain now. As you can see, it's going to be pretty intense driving through this rain because we're not going to be able to see the tornadoes for a while until we get right up close to them. Now for some of the eagle-eyed viewers, you may notice this tab here. This is simply a custom vehicle tab. It was graciously given to us for a cinematic project that Tofu and I are working on, so uh, pay no attention to that. That will uh, be temporary, so there we are. Now we are going to continue making our way towards this tornado, and we're not going to be able to see anything for quite a while because this rain is very heavy. Ooh, sorry to cut you off, Jesse, but there is a debris ball right over Funkly right now. Yeah, oh, it, just it just went away, but yeah, there was a debris ball for a second, so it is impacting Funkly, it seems. Looks like that tornado is sort of like a drill bit right now, which is when the yeah. tornado gets really thin at the bottom and does extreme damage. It's doing some sidewinding stuff a little bit, and it's getting narrower. That is a textbook tornado shape right there. All right, I'm going to grab some probes because I'm going to need it right now. I'm in the path. I'm going to drop one. Here we go. All right. We only have really one road to go off this, so this is going to be a very dangerous intercept right here. And the couple is looking like it's getting stronger. The TVS now upgraded to pink, so... Yeah, so that means it's probably above 140 miles per hour. I'm scanning 136 right now. Oh, wow. Yeah, so that kind of lines up wow. then. Also getting All some right. mail now. Actually, I yeah. might be dying. It's 132 now. All right, I'm going to drop another tornado, fluctuation. bro. All right, deploy. The tornado is getting really close, and I can barely see it. All right, I'm deploying right now. I'm going to drop some probes. I see some uh, leaves falling off the trees there. Uh, it's going to yeah. pass right next to me. Yeah, it's passing right behind me. No, I think it's right on top of you, Jake Cullen. I saw you get... Yeah, no, it's right on yeah, direct. Yeah, you it's, direct. It's, yeah, it's right behind me. Wow. Yeah, this thing's, this thing's dying. It's 121 now. The wind field around this tornado seems to be relatively weak. The probes are right next to it, and it only got like 68 miles an hour. Yeah, it's yeah, a very... I think I was 89. Oh very small wind base all right i'm gonna go back recover my probes and do we have another storm uh we do have another rotation that popped up next to funkly actually what are we oh it's, oh, it's already oh, it's right oh. here oh, it's, uh, oh my it's God. touching down or it's floating or something we're getting some tornadic winds right really, now. really the trees gotta, are going crazy eat. yeah I, I have 51 miles an hour my mezzanet this I, I'm going to try and push ahead. Yeah, this thing's fluctuating a lot. I, th I think it's right on top of us, Jay Killen. Jay Killen, are you intercepting this tornado? This new one? Uh, I placed a probe down at the intersection. I'm probably going to go up a little bit and see if there's another good spot I could deploy at. 
Alright, sounds good. I see the tornado, and it is now starting to cross the road. My probe's reading 103, 108 now. 113. It's in the EF2 range. Alright, I'm going on this dirt road. Uh, going east. Gonna try and get in front of it. This thing's pretty strong. Oh, yeah, it's hitting miles miles per hour. hour. There's a bunch of power flashes. All right, I'm heading that way right now, so now. I will see the town in just a minute. All right, the winds are getting pretty intense over here. I've got to watch out. Yeah, so my first probe that I placed on the intersection, uh, I got 115 miles per hour, and then on this dirt road just to the south of Wobbin, uh, I got 136, which is low end EF3 range. I'm not sure if it's any stronger now. It probably isn't. Yeah, I'm watching this monster tornado. It's going through the field. It did do some damage, but this could also be from the previous tornado. What's a little weird is these homes are damaged, yet that red house is completely fine. Oh my gosh. The two tornadoes are practically next to each other right now. Yeah, if, yep, it's gone. Yep, there yep. we are. All right. Well, I'm staying hit by RFD now. Hello, Dow. How are you doing? I'm Dowing. Well, you're not going to be Dowing for long. Well, neither are you. You've just slammed into the side of a 30-ton uh, semi-truck. And somehow have survived. Oh, that is not good. Oh, my gosh. There is a mobile home that got tossed over oh. the road. What? Into a cornfield or wheat field. All right, we have some injuries here, but they're alive. Oh, oh what was uh, that? We have an extra died. one. Tofu has died, guys. That is very this unfortunate. Is a terrible tragedy. He hit the Dow. And it looks like we have a new storm. So yeah. that's a plus. Ben and I are already on that storm. So what do you think the game plan is from here? Right now, I'm healing up the people in Funkly, but I'll be on that storm in just a moment. I guess we'll do the usual split of me and Ben and Jesse and Jay Killen together. Probably. Yeah. All right, so I was able to heal up the people that I could see and help, and uh, yeah, now I'm going to be chasing this storm. You can see there's going to be a hook developing in just a moment. Actually, there might already be one, but no wall cloud yet. Also, a uh, couplet right yeah, Oh, there's also a funnel got a driver funnel driver down. Down. Yep. Oh my god, everyone all at the same time. Where is that touching down? Oh my gosh, over Hazleton. The center of Hazleton, yeah, that, this is not good. Just struck by lightning. Oh, oh huge power flash. flashes. Oh, oh it is a God, light show over Holy there. Holy cow. There it goes. I can see that from Funkly. It's a massive tornado. It just touched down. Oh my God, yeah, I see that. I'm going to try and cut it off um, through the road by 10 killer. It's going into the Hazleton strike. Lake section right now. Those power flashes are crazy. Yeah, I got a pretty good view from back here. It is not looking good. All right, Ben, what's your game plan? Are you doing the same um, route as I am? Yeah, I was going to go up uh, 15, but I couldn't see the tornado, so I didn't know exactly uh, how large it was. I didn't want to risk it. I'm going up uh, Widina 48 and hopefully catch it off guard that way. Oh, it's re-condensing, re Oh, yeah, I yep, see Yep, dropping it. down. We got debris. Wow, look at that. It is tossing some trees. That oh, is a very large a tornado. Here. Oh. Yeah, from my perspective I can see it is uh it is definitely a wedge. At yep. this point I don't I don't think we're gonna be able to get a probe onto it. Uh I can, I can. I mean it's it's moving so fast we may not be able to get in front of it on uh twenty. I'm gonna go I'm gonna try and go to twenty six. I think I might be able to. I'm just parallel with it. Oh no. No no no, I don't think I can. Because it's just yeah, crossing it's, the it's, bridge right now. It's wow. like on twenty six. I'd say Sorry. we should try and do try and Though, actually, it probably wouldn't be a good idea because you'd end up getting cornered is if you could somehow make it to the entrance ramp and go onto the very north. It's, it's already on the bridge. Yeah, yeah it's, it's it just made it there. It's cross 26 already. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get close to it and see what the uh, wind field is like. All right, I'm going to slow down right here. Winds are up to 70. Yeah, the wind field is actually w. pretty low. The winds are getting pretty strong for me, though. I'm getting like 70 miles an hour, like, jumping from like, a lot. I'm going to get my probes now. Yeah, 80 miles an hour over the uh, overpass here. We've got an error at the moment, but I'm still going. You got a new storm popping up over Trent. All right, yeah, that sounds good right. because this I'll one's going off the map. Towards that. Yeah, I don't want to jinx it, but just based on the position of the storm, I feel like something bad is really going to come out of this thing. Oh, yeah, no, That's I feel that job. as well. All right, I'm off the highway, and I'm going to start making my way east to try to get ahead of the hook which is developing just there. Yeah, I'm gonna cut through the clear slot when I reach, I'm almost actually, I'm almost in the clear slot. Uh, 
don't uh, I see the wall cloud or at least where it's gonna be oh we've got uh, ground circulation now uh yeah I, I think it it's might be dirt particles oh I see you down okay. there yep, all right, I'm gonna start deploying wow that thing just oh, I wedged can see the down. now uh oh all right my probes are all down I'm running time power flashes oh, power flash behind me like right behind me Oh, this Looks thing's like coming it's the, uh, the RFD me. that's wrapping around that's really causing those power flashes. Probe is dropped. I'm getting out of here. Holy cow. Oh, wow. Major power I'm flashes. I'm getting some wind like all the way over here on the uh, Wadena 48 road. I think it's just oh. RFD, though, that I'm getting, but still right. getting some extensive wind. Dropping another probe. Here we go. The winds aren't super strong now, but I'm getting closer and closer to the funnel. It's red TBS. Red? Oh, I got 85, yep. 100. Oh, there Power we go. Flashes over the, uh, in your 10 strike. Yeah, I can see that funnel. there. 113, 134. What the heck? 142. This thing, is rapidly this thing rapidly intensifying. It's going to hit the what? radar technologies building right now. Yep. Power oh, flash no. is right there. Oh, my oh, gosh. Lucky. Oh, no, wait. Nope. That's subvort. Holy cow. Oh, I was close to death. That thing was at 173 miles an hour. I think a couple more and I would have been lofted. Hey, Jay Kellen, do you mind if I uh, quickly jump into your TIV? Uh, if you can. All right, here we go. We're starting to breach 100 miles per hour. Oh, wow. All right, I'm going to watch right, my truck here. It. There goes my truck rolling, and it's gone. Yeah, I wouldn't have survived. 151's the highest so far. Actually, 152. It's shaking pretty badly. Okay, it's Rain starting to settle down more. now. I think it's ju yeah, it just now passed. All right. Wow, this thing is really fast. Yeah, I was really nervous about driving down this road, so oh, we got I just gave up. Down south. Yeah, really? This thing is just... Oh, my God. All right, so the peak winds so far recorded for this tornado is 187. Uh, Dang. Yeah, I think Gemmel is gone. I don't even know where my truck is. It's hey, the TBS probably is in the field. Above it. Oh, I think I see it. There it is. All right, I'm going to take a look at Gemmel. This thing, it just yeah. flattened it completely, I feel like. Isn't Gemmel mobile homes? Small uh, homes and mobile homes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I wow. think there's a few normal homes, but there's also mobile homes there. I'm being very cautious right now. The, the snapped wooden power poles are not a good sign. Yeah, that's that's a foundation of a house. Oh yeah, these mobile homes are gone. They're oh, rolled yeah, off. They're all over the road, damage. scattered. This is yeah, this is awful. All right, I'm pulling up to the town right now. I was able to recover my truck. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's bad. It is yeah, very I'm doing some bad search here. and rescue. Yep, me too. I'm going to go and chase this storm all the way south because it looks like it already dropped. And uh, they, Ben, you're on that already, right? Yeah, I'm just going to hold position on uh, Kasoda 2. Uh, it looks okay. like it's going to come like right towards me. Half of these roads are impassable. There's debris completely covering the road. Hey, J. Killen, have we had any fatalities in this town? I haven't gotten any. Uh, No, I don't think so. I okay. think it's just been injuries. That is a miracle. And it's probably because we were right there. Yeah, like right afterwards, like right after it hit the town. Yeah. Hey, Jay Killen, I'm going to go down to the radar building and see what's left. Okay. Oh, that does not look good. It's gone. It's destroyed. Wait, really? It is? Yeah. Uh -oh. There is one outer wall remaining. Well, oh, it's might, uh, uh, poor Hazleton. I think that it's makes it four yeah, from what radar. I remember. Look at radar. Oh, look no, at radar. no, no, look at radar. no, no. What's going on? I'm radar. Look at radar. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Okay, um... I'm, all right, I'm gonna reposition. Uh, there are yeah, I'm people here now. that are injured. I need to, um... Well, there's one person that has died. All right, I'm gonna work my way down to uh, Hazleton right now. Yeah, I'm doing that right now as well. Yeah, uh, this thing's Tornado Mercy has it. been issued for Hazleton. There are yeah. some roofs being lifted in Almora, but I think that's the least of our worries now, considering the biggest city is going to get hit. I think it'll probably get grazed. I think there's just the thing with the warning box where it kind of points northwest, even though it's most likely heading, like, north or northeast or something it's still gonna be oh, really yeah, close and probably will hit a few towns all right uh i might get on the road you guys are on but i don't know if it's too late to do so it might be too late all right i'll push ahead a little more oh power probably flash is right deploy. here power uh -oh. flash is right Whoa, on these yeah, power lines over here backing wow. up i see a lot dude yep they're going off everywhere all the way through the town we also have a new storm down south uh yeah. There's a new rotation south of Pirate I was about Lake. to intercept it. Actually, I'm going to go to that one. All right, sounds good, Ben. All right, I'll I'm follow you, of it. actually. What are the winds, Jay Killen? Uh, so far, the highest uh, I've gotten about 121 miles per hour. Oh, wow. All right, I'm going to try to core punch this, but this is where things get really dangerous because I could come face to face with this tornado and not know it until there's no time left. I'll be sucked into the tornado. 
So it is yeah, super this dangerous. Is, this is as far as I'm going. Sounds good. All right, I'm out of the rain and hail, and this is a massive tornado. It's going multi-vortex right now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm in a bad spot. I gotta get out of here. Houses are being ripped apart. All right, I'm gonna, I'm heading, my, making my way down now. Oh my gosh, trees are going down now. Instead of trying to uh, race ahead of it, I'm just gonna try to get to the one side of the tornado. This is very bad. My vehicle is moving slowly, but I think, there we go. Yeah, I just escaped the tornado. Trying to go down south to get an intercept, because since I think it's basically going directly up the road. The gas station is destroyed, but the pumps are still there. So I would assume it is below EF4 strength. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I can't tell, but I think there's a house completely gone. Yeah, there is no house here. There's actually a house shifted off its foundation over here as well. So yeah, that wall cloud to our uh, southwest because of the new storm that popped up. That's a little concerning. I do see it there. I'm still trying to heal up all these people. And since the storms are moving northeast, that is a little bit concerning. To be fair, like basically most of the tornadoes, they move like a north, northeast direction. So it's probably just gonna barely miss Prior Lake. Hopefully. Well, that's unfortunate. This tornado is going directly into Trent, but we're gonna take a look at the past tornado tracks and uh, see what they did. So we're going to day one. We've got six tornadoes here. We're gonna start with tornado number one. This one went through Funkly, and you can see the damage there. That was an EF2. The second tornado followed that one, and you can see that was an EF1. And there is the damage there. The third tornado is unrated and went through the uh, outer portions of Hazleton into the Hazleton Lakes, down the highway, and uh, then died. The fourth tornado was the one to go directly through Gemmel and uh, that got an EF3 rating. The damage was pretty bad on that one. Tornado number five is unrated. This one was predicted to go into Hazleton, but barely missed it. And tornado number six went through Prior Lake. All right, so with that tornado dying in the distance in my vehicle doing something, I think this would be a good point to end off the video. Not exactly sure what just happened, but uh, whatever it was, it was pretty catastrophic. And if you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And I'll see you all next time, guys. Goodbye.